10 Most Amazing Fish Farming Machines The need for eco-friendly and cost-effective fish farms is growing in the aquaculture industry. Farmers are using state-of-the-art technology and fish-raising devices to keep up with consumer demand. Farming fish is a kind of agriculture specifically designed to produce fish for human use. Farmed fish may be raised in fresh, brackish, or salt water in man-made ponds or tanks. Aquaculture has several benefits over wild-caught fish. One benefit is that fish populations can be managed more effectively. This also has the dual benefit of protecting wild fish populations from exploitation and guaranteeing a steady supply of fish. Aquaculture has additional positive effects on water quality since it recycles nutrients and supports local ecosystems. Technology advancements in recent years have allowed for the creation of fully automated fish farms. Machines are used in these farms for a variety of purposes, including fish feeding, tank cleaning, and health monitoring. There are a lot of advantages to using automation in fish farms. They improve productivity while also reducing the number of people needed to do the task. They help farmers keep a closer eye on their fish populations to control the spread of illness. While automated fish farms have many advantages, they also have their share of problems. In addition to requiring careful design and administration, they may be rather costly to put up and keep running. However, they provide a possible answer to the problems that have plagued conventional aquaculture. Here are the top 10 most amazing fish farming machines. Number 10. Water Pumps A fish farm cannot function without water pumps. The farmer may use this to fill up the ponds and drain them as necessary. A fish farm, on the other hand, should ideally be situated on sloping terrain so as to make use of gravity, in particular when discharging the pumped in waters. Two kinds of pond pumps are often used in a fish farm. The first one is the centrifugal pump, and the second is turbine. In any case, the pond's water must be moved about efficiently with the help of these pumps, regardless of the drainage method or pump types you choose to use. 9. Fish Feeding Machine The farmer may schedule the feeding machine to automatically discharge feed into the pond at set intervals. However, before releasing feeds into the ponds, you should check to see that the feeders are in good working order and contain sufficient quantities of fish food. If you're a farmer, you may get your hands on tools like grinders, mixers, and pellet making equipment to create your own fish meals. 8. Aerators slash air pump Aerators and air pumps are installed in ponds to enhance the amount of dissolved oxygen there is, which in turn attracts more fish. The oxygen levels on fish tanks are maintained by the use of these air pumps. Using this technique allows for a better managed environment for the fish being farmed. The principal advantage of an air pump is the increased precision with which oxygen levels in the water can be maintained. It may also help the farmer save fish that otherwise might have died from lack of oxygen. Water quality may be enhanced by employing an air pump, which is another advantage. 7. Aquaculture Tanks Water tanks, also known as aquaculture tanks, may be used to breed fish and other aquatic creatures or to cultivate aquatic plants for consumption or commercial purposes. Concrete, plastic, and metal are just some of the materials that may be used to construct aquaculture tanks, which come in a wide range of sizes and designs. A broad range of aquatic organisms, such as fish, shellfish, and crustaceans, may be reared in aquaculture tanks. It is also possible to cultivate algae and seaweed in aquaculture tanks. Both saltwater and freshwater are acceptable for use in aquaculture tanks. 6. Micro Nanobubble Generators Using micro nanobubbles is cutting-edge technology now being used in aquaculture. These bubbles are produced by a bubble generator, and the bubbles produced by these machines are much smaller than those produced by more conventional bubble generators. Micro nanobubbles have the benefit of bringing more oxygen into the water, which is essential for the fish's health and growth. Micro and nanobubbles may also help filter out harmful chemicals, improving the water quality and making it safer for the fish to swim in. 5. Aquaculture Oxygen Production Equipment Aquaculture oxygen generation equipment is a valuable resource for fish growers. Aquaculturists may raise healthy fish by maintaining high amounts of dissolved oxygen with the help of this machine. This is of utmost significance in systems where fish are bred in very dense populations. Oxygen production equipment for aquaculture comes in a wide range of styles. But to get the most out of their farms, farmers should invest in machinery that meets their specific demands and economic constraints. 4. Oxygen Diffusers 
Oxygen diffusers are used in aquaculture to assist keep the water's dissolved oxygen content consistent. Fish and water quality both benefit from this. Bubbles of oxygen are dispersed across the water by this diffuser. Fish are able to get oxygen from the dissolved bubbles that float to the top. Several models of oxygen diffusers are commercially available and are required equipment for every fish farm. Depending on your specific requirements, you should choose the most appropriate kind. Mechanical and chemical oxygen diffusers are the two most common options. Chemical diffusers employ a chemical process to produce oxygen, whereas mechanical diffusers use a pump to create bubbles. 3. Ozone Generator Equipment Machines like ozone generators are used in fish farming to aid in water quality and reduce parasites and germs. For water purification, ozone gas is created by ozone generators and then pumped into the water supply. This gas is effective against parasites and bacteria, and it also aids in the decomposition of organic waste in the water. Aquaculture ponds may benefit greatly from the use of ozone generators, which produce ozone in a safe and effective manner. This may be used with ease and does not need maintenance. As part of their water treatment infrastructure, many fish farms use ozone generators. 2. Automatic Floating Fish Feed Pellet Machine Feed pellets that float are often utilized in aquaculture. Instead of sinking, they float on the water surface and gradually disintegrate, releasing food particles. And these types of feed are released with the help of automatic floating fish feed pellet machines. Successful fish farming relies heavily on floating fish feed pellets because they can provide a more consistent supply of nutrients, which may improve crop yields. To get the best results from fish farming, it's crucial to choose the right floating fish feed pellets for the species being bred. 1. Sedimentation Tank Machine In the world of aquaculture, a sedimentation tank is an essential piece of machinery. Solid waste, such as uneaten food and fish poop, may be removed using this machine. Over time, the accumulation of this unwanted waste may harm water quality significantly. Large rectangular tanks filled with water are often used as sedimentation tanks. The garbage will eventually settle to the bottom of the tank, where the sloping floor will collect it. Sludge is pumped out of the tank and disposed of in the right way. The use of sedimentation tank machines is crucial in every aquaculture setting. They also do their part to eliminate water pollution. These machines are among the most incredible and efficient fish farming devices that are now on the market. They have the potential to completely transform the way we farm fish, making it both more effective and more environmentally friendly in the process. We hope that this video has sparked your interest in learning more about fish farming and the ways in which these devices might help us build a future that is more environmentally friendly.